Hey everyone, it's me, that game here, back with another episode, and in this episode, we are going to be doing a discussion of Lego Incredibles, the new Crime Waves trailer, if you guys have seen it. Now, let's get right into it. First, as you can see, is Mr. Incredibles' old car. I love this car, so I'm hoping that you can use this in the game, in Free Roam. I'm really excited after watching this, especially up for this game, I'm super excited. Let me know if you guys are excited to drive this car. And on to the next one. In this screenshot, we see Elastic Girl in her new costume from Incredibles 2. If you guys haven't watched that trailer, well, I'm pretty sure you have if you're watching this. But anyways, this is her new suit that she uses in Incredibles 2 throughout most of the movie. I think anyways, so I think that it's safe to assume that we can play in this costume in free roam and everything. And that's really cool. I really like the, all the like colors, the dark, well, the light gray, red, and black. It looks really awesome. On to the next one. In this screenshot, we see Frozone in a snowman costume complaining about how it's not his super suit. I'm, this is, this was really funny. And... If you guys haven't watched the first trailer, you would know, well, if you have watched it, you would know that he was wearing kind of like a outfit that Nick Fury would have worn, but in this one, he's wearing the one that he wears in the movie, which is really good. I, I like that they changed that, and I'm, I hope you can play as Frozone in that costume. That would be so funny and really cool. On to the next one. Right here we can see his screen slaver and I'm very excited to play as this guy because as I watched the Lego Incredibles trailer I thought that this guy was super cool and looked super cool so I'm very excited to play as this guy and I was wondering about this it looks like that this might be his hideout or maybe a level because that is like a idle action if you just sit there as a character they'll start to do something and I think this is his so this being in here, I think that you can go in here and free roam, which is going to be really cool. Right here we can see Underminer, which is really cool. I like this character. I've I've been wondering, but I've been wondering about this character. Like, is was he going to be in the game? Of course, I recognize it because if you look at the concept art, he would be on the right side, which is pretty cool. I really like how they like put the, I think number two stuff on the right, number one stuff on the left, which is very cool. And also, I really like his character design. I think it's really cool and neat. Right here, you can see Syndrome, which is very cool. I like how he looks. I think he looks like the minifigure they made, but I really like him in Lego form. I really think that all the characters... They done they done pretty good and they done actually really good and I'm excited to see what exact his abilities are in the game and everything. Right here we have Bon Bomb Voyage. I remember this guy from the movie. I actually just recently watched number one again because I was getting ready for number two. Um it looks like that this is in free roam, maybe at the because I th he's a crime lord. So I think that this is like the boss fight. This is like a cutscene or something for the boss fight. And I really think that they did a really good job on him. He looks really good. Right here we have a nice screenshot of Dash running. I, th I really like this because the graphics look awesome. The color is awesome. And you can see a construction worker right there. And I think it's really cool. That's, oh, and you can, like, see some costumes in the background and everything. And a slippery fo floor sign. On to the next. I picked this screenshot because it's a really good example of the day and night cycle. It's about to turn night. Or, yeah, it's about to turn night. Which I think is really awesome. And Frozone right there. I was wondering if, because if you guys play Lego Marvel Superheroes... Iceman can do that, but like disappears. Hopefully, you can just stay in the sky instead of falling because it's like a glide. You glide down. 
But on to the next one. Right here you can see the city at night, which I think is very cool. Seeing all these screenshots in the trailer that was just showcased what gets me super excited for the game because I remember watching the number one and number well I didn't watch number two yet. I remember watching number one and it just would be so cool to play in this world. So I'm very excited to see how it is in it when we actually get to play. Right here you see the up house which I think is a very awesome touch. And if you guys look it's in a construction site. From I think it's from when the house is by like a construction site in the movie which is really cool. And I'm very excited. I think you might be able to go inside of it which I think that that is very cool. Anyways guys this is going to be the end of the episode. Also I am going to do a Fortnite a 50 version 50 version 2. If you guys did enjoy, don't forget to join Teacher Corp today. And also, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, like a boss. I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.